This first step is done on a different computer. Also, you shall lose all your data on your Asus, but it is a worthy price to pay to get your PC back, right? Hello guys and welcome to yet another Asus Central video with me your host Victor Ogwari. I know it has been a really long time since I uploaded a video onto this channel, but I was in school, I was I have just finished my exams today. This is 28th of February. I have finished my exams today and I'm free to make videos for you guys to help you solve the, the upshow setup utility thing. But before I begin, it is important to realize that um, this upshow setup utility attacked you because of uh, poor maintenance of your PC. Um, I will help you guys to maintain your PC so that it doesn't affect you in the future. So why don't you go ahead and subscribe to this channel and hit the bell right beside it to receive notifications whenever I upload a new video. So I know in the previous videos I had said that it will cost you about $10 to fix it but I went and maneuvered my ways and now it will cost you nothing. I made this website, Askogwari, this one over here, where you can uh, you click this button free tutorials it leads you to my channel but that is not really important right now what is important is this free download over here it's the media creation tool that you would initially buy it for ten dollars in the other website but um, I created my own website and decided to give it to you guys for free so if you download it and uh, and uh, here it is, here is the download. If you download it and follow my steps, you will actually save your computer. But anyway, below the free download there is a donation button. If this media tool helps you, I'd like you to support me by donating some few cents here and there. If you feel touched enough, you can do donate any amount you like. The, the reason I need a donation is because uh, I need to pay for web hosting. Uh, this website is only free for 28 days. So after 28 days, actually, they have sent me an email over here. You see, this is my email, SS Central. Uh, last chance to save your site. You still have time to act fast, Victor. Save, blah, blah, blah. So I actually have to pay some some top dollar over here to restore my website so that you people can use it freely so if this media tool over here that you downloaded if it helps you if you feel touched enough or if you have some money you can donate some here and I'll pay for web hosting so that it, the website can last here forever anyways after downloading it now I am moving on to the steps that you will need for you to save your computer. Now, assuming you have made the download, uh, my downloads normally go to downloads over here. Um, here it is. Assuming you have made the download, you will receive a zip file like this. So what I need you to do is right click on it and extract all. And click extract. And here it is, the media creation tool. Let me drag it to the desktop. So you should have such an icon. Now what I need you to do is be connected to the internet. You need to be online. And then you double click this icon. Then as it runs, just plug in your flash disk. That should be above 4 GB. I suggest 8 GB. And now it will start getting a few things ready so you have to be a little bit patient over here and remember your flash disk is plugged in 8 GB or greater than 4 GB just accept these terms and wait for it to load uh, this might take some time so get yourself some uh, some coffee or something to do 
can be playing some video game elsewhere. But I promise you it will take your time. But eventually your computer will be okay. For free. And we don't want to upgrade this PC, we want to create installation media on USB flash drive. So just add a check mark right next to this create sentence, then click on next. Everything here should be at default. Leave the language at US, Windows 10, 64 bit. If your computer is 32 bit, this place will be written 32 bit. But anyway, just click on next. And then USB flash drive at least 8 GB click next and here is my flash disk it's called Oguari that is my surname click next On your AppShow Setup Utility, scroll to the right to Security option, then the lowest option is the Secure Boot menu. Click on it, then the Secure Boot Control should be disabled. If yours is enabled, disable it. Then go ahead and press Escape for Back. Then after that, go to the Boot menu. Boot media which is our flash disk and press any key now with the boot media plugged in that is with my flash disk I am going to switch off this computer by holding down the power button like that now the computer has gone off now I'm going to give it time then I'm going to restart it now this is another step that calls for your patience. You will have to wait a little bit for this process to proceed as per the video. Then there shall appear a chain of circles going in cycles. Now this is normally a very good sign. A sign of hope to be precise. Now after this it will bring you to a blue screen like this one. Written Windows install now. And that is exactly what we are doing in this video. We are installing Windows. So just click on install now. And then the setup will begin. This might take some time depending on your computer. Then it will give you options of Windows. There are three options. Home, Pro and Enterprise. I think many people have Pro. So I will just go ahead and choose Home. Then click on Next. Then Relax. Just wait some moments. Windows license terms. Nobody ever reads them, just accept them. This is just collecting information. Windows is collecting information like you accepting its terms and conditions. Now, after you have accepted, just press next. And then custom install. Custom install. After you've custom installed, it will bring you. To this screen now ladies and gentlemen this is the screen that determines if you're going to lose all your data or you're going to save a sum or you're going to have all your data at the end of this process 
Now, if you have one option, you are going to lose everything. There are cases in this step where people have multiple options. They are the lucky ones. If you belong to this group, there should be a link appearing on the screen. Click on it. That is your tutorial. If the link is unavailable, just check for it in the description. For the rest of us who have only one option, the unlucky group, we will just have to proceed with this tutorial. I am sorry, but you have to format this disk. And by formatting, it means you lose everything. Everything that you have ever owned in your computer, valuable or not, you have to lose it. Now click on next. And uh, there, the installation will begin. It will start ticking these things, it will give them green ticks, all of them. This might take some time, so I will pause the video and come back when it is done. That took a while, but we are here. This is the next screen. Windows need to restart to continue. Now your computer may restart several before this process ends. It will go off and on and off and on a couple of times. So there, it has gone off. And Asus is now searching for incredible. Expect a chain of circles going in circles. There. Now, like I said, this is a sign of hope. Now, your computer is getting devices ready. This will also take some time and require a lot of patience. But once you are here, you are assured that your computer is safe. Oh, and by the way, after this process, just give your computer time to rest. It has been sick for long, so it won't be functioning well for some time. But, like, after three hours, your computer will be up and running. Very healthy. Now, this screen normally, it doesn't appear, but at times it may appear. So if it appears, just let it be. It will load up some percentages up to a hundred. Then your computer will restart and give you some many many options like this one. A lot of things to read. Now I don't want to customize my windows so I will I will just use the factory settings. And just a moment. will ask me for my computer name the one that you see before you sign in to your computer and passwords so I've filled them chief of worry my passwords then just another moment now I think this is the last step setting up Cortana of course I need Cortana so I'm going to use Cortana just another moment. Hi. Let's begin. No, we are happy you are here. Let's begin. We are happy you are here. Um, getting things ready. Yeah, once you see these things, just know you are on the right path. Let's start, not let's begin. After this, I think your computer is ready. So yeah, like you see, you have nothing. Even your wallpaper is gone. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please leave a thumbs up. And also don't forget to comment with stuff you didn't understand and questions. Don't forget to subscribe. 